Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel and welcome back to another video. Uh, up at the storage yard today, it's windy, it's sunny, but do you know what? Any day of the week. <laughs> um, so Kia Sportage in the background, uh, we've now had it two weeks um, and it's absolutely fabulous. I am so pleased that we got this car. Um, you know, the Sanyon Corando was good, but uh, as you've uh, seen in previous videos, I'll leave a link up here to that one, um, that it had quite a few problems uh, and there was just no way that um, it was viable to spend uh, the money that I needed to spend on it to get it up to code. So what we did, we went out and we bought a Kia Sportage. This is a 16 plate uh, Kia Sportage. It's um, not done a great deal of mileage. mileage. Um, it's still only done uh, under 37,000 miles. Uh, I've not put any mileage on it at all since I've had it in the last two weeks. Um, but uh, we will be uh, on the 11th of September. I have been telling everyone in my videos that we're actually going away at the end of August. But uh, when I've looked, you know, I don't know what it is with us lately. We just seem to be giving out dates wrong all over the place. But uh, I'm sorry, I apologise, but we are going away on the 11th of September. Uh, and uh, we're going down to Wareham Forest Touring Park. That much I do know. But anyway, the Kia Sportage, beautiful car, petrol blue in colour. And um, you'll be seeing a few other bits uh, and pieces of this uh, car in the video, uh, in our videos. Um, but uh, one thing I just wanted to touch on very, very quickly, uh, and that is the tow bar company that actually put the detachable tow bar on. Uh, and that is a company called Southern Tow Bars. Now, they've done a really good job. Uh, I'll leave all the links uh, to the company in the description down below, and uh, maybe you can use them. Uh, you know, maybe they can give you a price and, uh, you, know, you, you know, for what you actually want. But um, they came and done the job uh, at my place of work. Um, and they've done a fantastic, fantastic job, and uh, I couldn't be more pleased. I really couldn't. Right, I just thought I'd stick this in here. It's uh, a last, uh, a last minute thing. So uh, I just wanted to show you um, the um, tow bar, the detachable tow bar that we actually went for. Um, so you have uh, the con the actual electric controls, which come down. They swivel down um, there. So that is a 13-pin socket push that up out of the way for the moment. Uh, this is the detachable tow bar and uh, it also has a locking mechanism on it as well so you can lock it but uh, just push that back on. Right we just take the cover off the bottom look at the cover and then that will go up into the hole. I don't really want to get down on the floor because it's uh, there it is. And that just goes in there and that's it it did click <laughs> i promise you it did click i was holding on to it but that's now in the green i've still got the keys um connected to the tow bar i've also got to clean the tow bar off the uh, tow ball off before anyone says it so i know i've got to do that but uh, at the moment the ball is black it will be nice and silver by this time next week but anyway yes that's it fitted so just do the complete opposite, push it in, twist it, and it comes off lovely and uh, easy. Right, so a couple of things that we've bought for the caravan. Uh, we bought some decals, which we want to put on the caravan, uh, similar to the ones that we put on the rear of the caravan, and I'll leave a link to that uh, video up here. Um, but um, yeah, I've got them here. I just wanted to show you, and I'll show you where we're going to put them. Uh, again, it's uh, Paul and Sarah, Caravan Life and uh, we'll show you where we're going to put them um, but uh, the other purchase we made uh, and uh, I know some uh, other caravanners have done it and I think I only know of one other person that's actually got it in this colour um, but we bought uh, an awning rail protector in yellow um, it's 12 metres long it's uh, we're going to cut it in half um, I've, I, I, you know I've seen it on uh, other YouTube channels, uh, they've literally just cut it in half and put one either side. Um, so that's what we're going to do. Um, I don't see any reason to go from uh, top to bottom. Um, uh, you know, if, 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 if there is a reason, then, you know, it's my bad. I'll have to buy another one. But uh, anyway, I'll leave a link for this uh, in the description down below. Uh, I think we got it on Amazon. Um, no, it wasn't. It was eBay. 10.99 for 12 metres. Um, so bargain, I think. Okay, so... 
this is where we're going to put the oh, excuse me uh, this is where we're going to put the uh, uh, decal we're actually going to put it along this area here um, not actually on the, the decal for coachman but uh, you know there's a space underneath here and I think this is going to be the best place for it so that's uh, going to basically sit there like that so let's remove it from its backing paper I'm just going to rub that on there make sure that it stays on the backing uh, on the plastic sorry uh, the, the clear plastic using my trusty caravan and motorhome um, card which I used last time so let's uh, just take this off it's a little bit windier up here today than what it was last time so let me just whoops grab hold of that okay I'm doing this freehand but uh, hopefully it'll turn out okay so I want that roughly in line with the C and then we'll just push that out I'm not going to be too hard with it because uh, it doesn't need it like I say I do like the decals I don't like the very big ones on the back I've, well it's not that I don't like them I just think that you know I, I, I don't um, you know it, it's, um, it's not for everyone anyway let me just go quiet a moment just to peel this off See how this looks. And there you go. Let's just get a microfiber cloth. Oops, hey. And just give that a little wipe. Okay, I think you could agree that that is quite good. Okay, so the other thing we want to do while we're here is I want to cut this in half. Uh, this is a 12 meter length, so uh, I'm hoping, fingers crossed, that six meters is going to be okay uh, for one side. I know that a lot of people would probably put in the whole length of the awning rail, but uh, to be honest, I don't really think that it needs it. Um, I've seen other YouTube channels where they've done that, and uh, it seems to work fine for them. So we're going to do exactly the same. So I will put my glasses on, and uh, we'll get this out of the bag. It's quite a warm day up here as well actually so what i'll do is i'll once i've cut it i'll lay it out for a little while just to take any creases um out of it but uh, oops put that in my pocket just so we don't lose that and uh find both the ends and uh then we can cut it in half oops No doubt it's going to get tangled up as well. So that's one end. Take that bit of tape off. Oh, come on, get off, get off, get off. A bit of tape, you never get them off your finger. Get off. There you go. Right, so we'll put them two together. <coughs> Excuse me. And then we'll find the end. Nice sharp scissors. And now we've got two bits. So we'll fit one to this side and then we'll fit the other one as well. I've actually neglected to bring up my uh, silicon spray, so um, I'm hoping, uh, because this is quite um, rubbery, uh, that we're gonna get a result. So uh, I'm gonna go for the other end. Um, that's it. Okay. I've also forgot my um, rattle gun, which I use to uh, take the um, feet up, stabilizer feet, um, which is what I would have used to uh, get the ladder up, which is underneath there. So never mind. We will soldier on. It's going in okay. I'm going to speak too soon in a minute, and it's going to end up. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> It's gonna end up binding up. So let's just move the steps.
could have done with Sarah's help up here today. But uh, we are going out this evening, so uh, she's at home um, doing what uh, you ladies like to do. For us men, it's a bit easier. Wash your face, put your clothes on, and we're going out. <laughs> so. I know James on caravan escapades, he had a, a problem getting his on and uh, I've watched him going backwards and forwards on his video <laughs> and uh, it looks like I'm going to be doing the same. So yes, James, I did have a little chuckle to myself. Um, and now, uh, yeah, it's getting its own back now. Like I say, it probably would have been easier if Sarah had been here, but never mind. There we go, that's got it. But uh, like I say, this was eBay. It was uh, 10 99 And uh, I thought that was an absolute bargain. I really did, you know. I think when you're on site, you can you only have to take the one off and leave the other one on. Um, you know, and uh, you know, if you lose your caravan on site, at least you can find it by the yellow strip on the side. <laughs> okay, so that is the awning rail protector fitted on this side, and we'll go to the other side. And we've also fitted it on that side as well. So all in all, I think this the 12 meter length of uh, awning rail protector actually is long enough to do both sides. Uh, I don't see any point in buying two of them. I really don't. I'm gonna um, I'm gonna push this edge up here uh, a bit further up because obviously you got the you got the um, gutter rail there. So I'm gonna go up a bit further so that it hangs a bit further off the back. But other than that, I think that's really good. Let me just do that now while we're here and go along here and just pull this along a bit so we're going to go to about there and what I'll do is I'll also do that on the other side as well I think um, which will make I think that's uh, about right now actually I'm going to pull that back sorry the OCD is starting to kick in now okay yep that's better, I think. Dear, really. Yeah, I think that's great. Anyway, she's going home in a couple of weeks so that we can give her a good wash uh, and give her a good uh, airing inside um, so we can get ready for the 11th of September. Um, can't believe we got that so wrong, but uh, anyway, we did. Um, but uh, yeah, I hope the you found this interesting with the awning rail um, and also with the little decals here um, you know like I say you know the big ones aren't for us really we um, we didn't want the big one uh, on the rear of the caravan we've got a little small one and we've also got these small ones here um, so yeah I like that but anyway I think we'll leave it all there and uh, we'll wrap this video up anyway like share subscribe please give it a thumbs up if you thought it was interesting and we will see you in the next one